Okay, so let me tell you about the weekend that I had. So, my friend done came from out of town, right? She has a daughter. The little girl was turning 12. She was bringing her out to California for her first time. You know, they're going to do all the little touristy stuff. The Universal Studios and the Avalon Stars. And, you know, they want to go to Roscoe's and all of that. Okay, so I decided, okay, well, I like to spend a little time with the little girl, get to know her. You know, I haven't seen her in a long time. I'm going to take her out. I'll take her out to lunch, and then we'll go to the mall, and I'll get a little outfit. So we go to the mall, hit the little store. She gets a couple things, and as we're walking out the store, the sensor, the uh, alarm goes off. So I said, oh, well, they must have left something on the thing. So she looks at me and goes, I got a shirt. I said, you got a shirt where? She said, in my purse. I said, girl, if you don't get to that dressing room and go and take that thing back and let me go to this counter and figure this thing out. So, I go to the counter and I tell the lady, oh, you must have left the sensor. You know, I'm going through all of this. Meanwhile, my heart is pumping, baby. And when I tell you my shit was bump, bump, bumping, okay? So, uh, go through that. Lady said, no, it's no sensor. I'm walk on over and swing it through to see if it goes off again. So, you know, I prance on over there, swing it through. It doesn't go off. Now, here she come out the dressing room. So she gets up to me and I said, oh, okay, everything's fine. And we walk on out the store. I grabbed her up by her arm so tight. Now, so you see my nails, right? Okay, baby, I was cutting, trying to cut to the white meat. And she was like, oh my goodness, you take it so seriously. It's not that big of a deal. My mom knows I do this. I said, oh, so you's a thief thief. Like, you be stealing, stealing. Like a booster, booster? Because y'all should have let me know, no. Because <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't do that. You know, I, that's not where I, I don't, I don't get down like that. You know what I'm saying? I, and you got me fucked up, fucked up. You know, because I was just taking everything I can do not to beat your ass ass. You see what I'm saying? So I take her home and tell her mama the story. And instead of this woman commending me on checking her daughter, she tried to check me. Talking about, um, I really wish you hadn't put your hands on my daughter. I said, you know what, fuck you and your jailbird daughter, okay? <laughs> Get into it, all right? That's what you could do. Fuck you and your jailbird ass daughter because I don't do that type of stuff. Like, don't bring that shit around me. I'm not trying to get locked up. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you mad that I almost cut your daughter's arm to the white me, you could press charges, charges. But you should know that we both going, going, because I'm going to snitch, snitch. Now, the choice is yours, yours, bitch, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Because, listen, okay, don't play with me like that. You know what I'm saying? So, needless to say, me and her are probably never gonna speak again and it's unfortunate because i liked her but her daughter's foul 